So what is the subject here? Matisse gave a simple title, La Gerbe, or The Sheaf in English. And we can see in this picture, it looks like fronds or sheaths of flowers and leaves. We can see the idea of perspective here, hinted by the different colours. The darker colours retreat back and the brighter colours pop out at us as if these particular fronds are closer by to us. It gives that idea of perspective and depth. And the longer and shorter fronds of the flowers and the leaves are indicated here too, giving that sort of organic shape that we would expect from a plant. It gives volume and depth. And the plume or the fanning here of the plant is important too. It's not symmetrical, this piece, but it indicates this idea of a, an organic symmetry that's pleasing to our eye. And the lines are simple, which is also easy for us to read this piece. It exudes and expresses joy, dynamism and energy as it explodes from the two-dimensional surface. Matisse said, although he was bedbound when he was making this work, this new style of work, these paper cutouts, enabled him to create a garden all around him inside his bedroom. He said, I have made a little garden all around me. Throughout his life, he used a variety of subjects. He used figures, still lives, interiors. But in the later years of his life, when he was making these cutouts, we see lots of organic forms. We see birds, snails, flora and fauna. Here, this work is altogether happy. We have the impression that who created this had the joy of life behind them. If we think that this final artwork, the ceramic that was made after this cutout design, was almost three metres by four metres, we can imagine how also this commission would bring a garden inside this private house that it was commissioned for. We can imagine just how impressive and how emotive that would have been in this private space. It would have been overwhelmingly uplifting. Matisse said, Said, what I dream of is an art of balance, an art of purity and serenity, devoid of troubling or depressing subject matter. And he seems to really have grasped that ethos here. Next, we're going to look at the materials that Matisse used to make this. Hope you liked the video. Like the video, subscribe to our page and spread the word. Thanks.